Overland Show, Stratford upon Avon, 2022, September edition. You wouldn't think so, it's absolutely beautiful. So like I say guys, we are at the Overland Show. So you've got the standard stuff, you've got all the stalls, you've got all the food, you've got all the drinks, you've got the market, um, we've got the trucks, we've got the big trucks, we've got vans, we've got cars, we've got people here on motorbikes, trailers. There's absolutely everything from small right up to really, really big. There's gonna be a lot of videos out about this show. I'm taking a different approach. I've picked a van for a decent van tour live here at the Adventure Overland Show. Let's take it away. Super excited to show you this van, guys. This is Armour 1983 MAN 4x4 long wheelbase, loads of goodies. The style of this van will just blow your mind. Come and check this out. I'm going to be the first one to say if someone come to me with a colour palette of British Racing Green, Orange, and Oak Wood, I would say that they're on something. But this van is super, super gorgeous. It is, honestly. I wish I had the nuts to pull something like this off. This van makes me feel like I am vanilla. You know, black leather, black units, black carpet. This makes me feel boring. Come and check this out, guys. I was super excited to do a van tour of this, um, of this van in particular because I do follow Mark on Instagram 
and I noticed since he started posting some decent reels, his layout is something that I actually considered in the past. I haven't seen it done anywhere else. He has an L-shaped system, but with a rock and roll bed there. So the rock and roll bed is right at the back and it offers all of this space here. Look at that socializing area. I mean, I have a U-shape in the back of mine, which is good. This is next level. So this vehicle does actually travel five. It travels five and it sleeps five. I will show you where shortly. But that socializing area is absolutely fantastic. That bed comes out, fills this gap. You push that cushion down in that gap, I believe, or you might even just get rid of that. And it's a bed, rock and roll bed, bang. Italian leather, brown forward slash orange. Can't really explain what color it is. It's absolutely beautiful. So to put it in perspective, I'm sat here, feet up, comfortable, space there, floor mount there for a table, loads of kitchen space, galley kitchen both sides, got a sink unit there, coffee machine, gin bar guys, there's a gin bar, this, this place honestly. As you guys know, I am a massive fan of access to cold drinks via the side door without having to get in the van so we've got the drawer style alpi cool fridge just for your cold drinks i absolutely love that but then on top of that he does also have the 80 liter um, fridge for all the foodstuffs So sitting in here now, I realise that myself, I kind of have a fear for trinkets. Like I keep, I keep all the surfaces smooth and empty and there isn't any need. I would think it would always be a bit too fussy, but in here, it's just so homely. I think my missus, my missus is coming down here later. I think she's going to love this um, layout number three of the Mercedes Sprinter on the way. Um, but Mark, he has decorated this so well, you know, there's coat hooks and there's um, little coat hangers. I put a little b bit of b-roll over the top. It's absolutely cool this little pull-out um, coat hook. You can do it nicely by putting um, the the extra creature comforts in there. Um, yeah, I've got to take a long hard look at myself and take a look at the van and just um, and take a leaf out of Mark's book really. So this is the van of the weekend. Um, Armour 1983. Go check him out on Instagram absolutely gorgeous van he uses this every single weekend um, he's from Scotland so the, the 4x4 does come in handy this is an absolute beast and I've got one more thing to show you oh yeah the top is popped check this out absolutely awesome so this does sleep five um, I know for a fact that Mark actually chooses to sleep up here um, because the bed's already made and you can just crawl on up here and go to sleep there's a tv a flip down tv above my head um charging points light points all of that kind of thing you just make so much use of that space absolutely massive double bed um he still has a solar panel fitted to the pop top itself absolutely great So let's run through some numbers. We've got 80 litres of fresh water underslung um, with 80 litres of waste also. Uh, there's an LPG tank underslung which serves a whale um, hot water and heating setup. So that is um, LPG, not a diesel heater. 200 amp hours of battery capacity. It is off grid. This thing is off grid. It's capable, it's gorgeous. Um, I love the style. Like I said, on paper, it makes no sense. Um, racing green with brown Italian leather with some oak units thrown in there and trinkets galore I absolutely love it this is a gorgeous build and once again thank you Mark for letting me um, take a look around your van today and playing the game with the ins and outs and uh, all the messing around with the camera work um, top guy thank you mate this van is absolutely gorgeous uh, so we've got the side ladder um, for access to the roof also with the extra bar 
Um, the additional bar here that allows um, surfboards, kiteboards um, being strapped to the side. Like I say, um, Mark uses this for all the purpose that, purposes that it's designed for. It's an absolute weapon of a vehicle. Uh, Max tracks up there, well, even though he is um, 4x4, additional spotlights everywhere. It's honestly, genuinely, a beautiful, beautiful build. Um, and it's done with such style. Uh, like I said, I really do need to take a long, hard look at myself and um, yeah, take a bit of this as inspiration. So a massive thank you to Mark um, Armour1983 for letting me take a look around his um, MAM 4x4 today at the Overland Show. It's an absolute beaut of a van. Go check it out on Instagram. All that's left to do is wait for the lights to go down because um, he has a party mode.